hey you guys i am back with a health update and happy meal so first i'm going to open up the happy meal and this is for my friend road kitten i have her on instagram hey girl and i have her on youtube as well hey girl i got it so i'm going to open it up oh oh my god she sent me the halloween stickers which i'm going to use to put on my calendar because I have a work calendar because I have a work desk so I'm definitely going to put these on there I can't wait for Halloween I am a Halloween freak and I love everything Halloween I can't wait for it my birthday party theme will be Halloween I love them and these are the stickers that everybody couldn't get their hands on it was really hard to get your hands on these if you haven't gotten them I love those stickers she also gifted me, hello, beautiful, love you, chica, a notebook. Oh, I love to write everything down. Look at how cute that is. It has, can you guys see the little rainbow on there? That is adorable. I'm a writer. I write everything down. I'm old school. I can't help it. And then something in this cute, adorable little box. Oh my god, it is so cute. I don't know if she made it. It has the little breast cancer right there. The little ribbon and the colors are adorable. They stand for the breast cancer theme, which is nice. Let's see if I could put it on by myself. Probably not. You know, when you put these things on, you need somebody to put it on for you. But look at how cute it's gonna look and it's gonna go great with my pink um i have a cute little pink um hair wrap and she put a little cushion in there <laughs> little cute balls which i'm gonna reuse i know for what for my gumball machine these are great for halloween so yeah this is so pretty I'm going to go ahead and have somebody put it on me. I'm on my way to work, as you can see. But look how adorable it is. Thank you, Chica. I love it. Okay, so this health update is about my hair. Um, I didn't know that when you do your second round of chemo, your hair falls off. Nobody told me that. I didn't even research that at all. I had, you know, I was just waiting for my hair to fall off so I can just shave it. But um, some young girl, or some lady here, messaged me on Facebook and told me, have you cut your hair off? Because on the second round, your hair is going to fall off anyways. It's just going to slide off like butter. So I was like, oh my God, I did my second round of chemo. And I went to go to take a bath and I noticed a ton of hair like just falling off and I thought that was the saddest thing in the world so I told my husband grab your cutters and just shave my head so I hold my son's hand really tight Antonio the oldest and he just shaved away and shaved away and we were crying but it was like a relief off my shoulders because I didn't want to go to the bathroom and take a bath and just have hair fall everywhere all the time i thought that would be so devastating for me and sad just to see my hair just fall off in pieces so i decided to shave it off and i felt like a weight off my shoulders like for some reason i felt lighter if that makes any sense now i have this hair wrap they're really easy to use and this is just a simple hair wrap that my friend chrissy got me thank you chrissy and um it's just like almost like it goes in a circle and it has a little stretchy in the back and you just put it on and you walk out so it's good to know that on your second round of chemo you guys your hair will fall off you need to shave it you need to shave it i don't care what anybody says you have to shave it off because it's a it's a stress that's off your shoulders my car is on i hope that doesn't I hope you guys can still hear me but it's a stress that's on your shoulders the beep is my charger um because you don't want to see it falling off you don't want to go through the whole thing and you don't want to feel uncomfortable so it's better just to shave it off and then buy yourself some cute hair wraps 
this is just a plain black one and so far somebody's like oh you look like a ninja you look like a gypsy which is funny i don't mind them saying anything because i really don't care i feel comfortable with my hair wrap i actually feel comfortable with it bald but i don't want to scare anybody who doesn't know like i don't want to scare like a kid and be like oh mom why does that lady have no hair you know because they don't understand and i wouldn't want to put somebody through that ordeal but i don't mind being bald in the house i'm just i take it off and i'm happy with myself i actually if i put a picture in here um i'll try to put in a picture of my head shaved bald just so you guys could see it i will literally show you but i don't know if you guys want to see it or that would scare you see how it looks bald but yeah you have to be like when you're having when you have cancer you have to be like cautious of other people you don't want them to be uncomfortable neither even though you're the one that's sick and you're the one that's going through i didn't think i would show you my head ever bald but i feel comfortable i don't know in my house i just wear it bald but yeah so second round of chemo you lose your hair definitely it's been crazy because i've been getting a lot of stomach cramps like cramps that like want to knock you out you know when you throw up so bad that you think you're gonna throw up your body because you have nothing else to throw up that's what has been happening to me and it's been hard but i managed to sorry guys i need to before i go to work but i need to like you know i don't know i've been going through it i've been taking my medicine i've been drinking and trying to eat healthy drinking a ton of water because the doctor wanted me to drink like a gallon a day or something like that of water so i've been drinking a ton of water my skin is so dry you guys it is dry my lips are dry all the time and my skin is so dry i guess because of the chemo and i heard that when i get the radiation therapy it's going to be even more dry so definitely gonna stock up on lip glosses not lip glosses but like carmax and something to make my lips smoother and my skin softer even though i do a good routine of it already but yeah it's crazy i'm gonna do my third round of chemo tomorrow no wait is it tomorrow yeah thursday so i'm gonna do my third round of chemo and um we'll see what happens so far i have no blisters inside my mouth they told me that i would get like a ton of blisters inside my mouth but thank god i have not gotten any i think it's because i've been keeping hydrated so i think that's what's been helping me through the whole process of the cancer i've been staying positive i've been trying not to cry i don't want to get emotional i'm trying to just stay positive right now i'm in a happy place you guys are amazing a lot of you guys have been sending me happy mail a lot of you ladies out there are amazing so thank you for that i love receiving happy mail not just because you give me something because i just love seeing a letter the writing you put in there you know a lot of you are new to emails or new to instagram i'm trying to get you every all you guys in there to instagram so you guys could go follow me i know it's hard but it's i'll guide you through the steps of it it's super easy and through the email process, I always like try to email you so you could have my email as well. But yeah, I've been keeping it busy. I have my son's birthday party coming up. So I'm going to do a couple of DIYs and I've been keeping busy with Halloween as well. So that's why I want you guys to join my Instagram because I have pictures there that I don't post on YouTube. But I'm trying to get to learning how to post on YouTube as well. Because I know it has a story mode and it has so many things. And I want to keep you guys posted on everything I do. But yeah, this is where I'm at with my hair. You know. You take it day by day. I know I miss my hair all the time. But I know that it's going to grow back. Hopefully <laughs> it grows back. And yeah. I just wanted to keep you guys updated. Thank you, Road Kitten, for my sweet little gifts i love them chica you are the best and if you guys want my happy mail address i'll link it down below on this video and until next time
I gotta go to work. Bye, you guys.